What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I have here in my hands what I believe to be the best putter grip in 2024. This is the Super Stroke Zenergy Pistol 1.0. So you can see the pistol grip, it flares at the top. Really gives a good feeling in, in the, uh, you know, the meat parts of your hand. Uh, so it really feels like you have a lot of control. This one is a no taper, so it's, it's straight. It doesn't get skinnier as it goes down. You can see that on this grip. This thing, it feels so, so good in the hands. Um, it's got a great tacky feel. This Zenergy Pistol putter grip comes in seven different color options as well as three sizes. I prefer the 1.0. Um, it's the smaller of the three. If you like a little bit bigger grip, you could go with the 2 or the 3.0. This is the best putter grip in 2024, hands down. It also has the tech port on top, as you can see there. Um, that is for, you can actually add counterweight on top or you can get a uh, performance tracking sensor. They sell those that people put on the end of their grips. You can put that on here and uh, get some data back on your putting strokes. So this is truly what I believe to be the best putter grip. Super Stroke is the number one putter grip brand on the PGA Tour for a reason. They've been around a while. This is a great putter grip and I'm gonna show you guys today. I'm gonna swap out this putter grip on my Odyssey Rossi S. So let's do it. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. All right, guys, so let's let's swap out this putter grip. Um, changing grips on any club is pretty simple. All you gotta do really is remove the old grip, remove the old tape. You'll need some double-sided grip tape, some grip solvent to slide the new grips on, and your grip. And that's really it. I mean, it's it's, it's that simple. Um, so don't you don't have to pay somebody to put your grips on. It's pretty easy to do it yourself. A kit like this, I think this solvent and uh, tape kit was on Amazon for like nine bucks or something. You get like, 15 grips, I think, so or grip tapes. So you can do your whole bag for like 10 bucks. So we're gonna swap out this putter grip and uh, put the new one on. Let's do it. First, you get your box cutter, cut off the old the old grip. Just cut that old grip off. Be kind of careful not to cut myself. That wouldn't be a good video. I will say one tool that does make changing grips easier is a vise, um, like a vise clamp. If you have one, you know, connected to a table that you could clamp it in, they sell, you know, the little plastic things that go around so you can lock the club in place, swap out the grips. That'd be a lot easier because I'm gonna have to kind of sit this thing down and jam the grip on, but just don't have a, just don't have a vice. So maybe something I need to invest in. I'm gonna make a slight mark where I know the center of this grip was, just so I know when I slide the new one on, I can kind of look down and, uh, you know, match up that line. So I'll get a marker and just draw, put a little dot right there that I know I'm putting the grip on exactly where I want it to be. All right, let's see if we can pull this sucker off. Got a little bit of grip left over. That grip tape was pretty good that the that Odyssey used. Mm. There we go. The Odyssey grip is no more. I'm actually just going to do the grip tape over the old. Um, it's not, I don't think it's going to make a difference for me. It might make it a little harder to slide the grip on, but hopefully it will be okay. I'm just gonna put the grip tape, so just put it on there, rub it down, and then we'll roll one side over. Okay, it's split down the middle for you to tear off the paper from both sides. All right, get that all pressed down. Yeah, I messed up. <laughs> I should have pushed this down before touching all this, uh, this grip here, this sticky tacky tape, but we got the grip on, we got the tape on. Now I'm gonna kinda just flatten this out at the top. And here is where we're gonna get our solvent ready. Don't, don't take the back layer of the double-sided tape off <laughs> until you get it pressed down flat. I'm gonna undo my solvent here. I just got this bucket just to keep the solvent from going everywhere. So what you wanna do is get the, uh, get the grip, fill the grip up with the solvent. Plug one in with the finger, squirt it all in there, fill up quite a bit, and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna squirt a little on here just for fun. We're gonna pour more on here in a second, but I just wanna be I wanna be I wanna be safe with it. Let's see, I'm gonna put more in here actually. Shake that up, get that inside of this grip all lubed up, and then pour out that excess all over this grip tape. That's the reason I brought this bucket out here, just to keep it from doing that. All right, now I'm gonna try to slide the new grip 
onto the putter. And I may have to do this on the floor over here, but let's see. So we'll just kind of slot it on. You can kind of guesstimate what's accurate. I'm just gonna use my body to pull against right now. But yeah, like I said, a vise to hold it in place is usually easier, but if you get it lubed up enough, it's not too bad. Just slide that grip on there and look at that. You know, wipe it off with a towel, get all that excess out of there, and you got a brand new grip on your putter. I'll go ahead and set this on the ground, make sure I got it all lined up. Make sure you have a towel too. <laughs> I had to run and grab this hoodie that was laying on the floor over here in my shop. Um, because there's a bunch of excess coming out of here. But here we go, we got a new grip. Now let me make sure I get this thing aligned right. And just like that, we're good to go. Man, we got a new putter grip. Um, I think it's like 12 hours or something you're supposed to let a putter dry, but you know, you may look that up <laughs> for yourself. But look at that, we got a brand new Super Stroke Zenergy Pistol 1.0. I love the red, I went with the red because it matches the Red Stroke Labs shaft. So that looks sweet. Get you one good look at the putter grip itself. I would say a, a vice would make it easier to line up, you know, make sure it's make sure it's square. Um, I just kind of did it with my foot and twisted it around, but that's pretty much how you regrip a putter. Super Stroke Zenergy Pistol 1.0, best putter grip 2024. If you think a different one's better, comment below what you think. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you on the next one.